What's up gang? Uh, so this one I'm going to use some sequencers to generate ideas and we will see how it goes. I haven't really got much of a plan for this one. I'm just gonna go in uh, winging it. See what happens. So I just have a little drum loop made. Simple uh, closed hat clap uh, tambourine and just a simple drum loop. So it sounds like this. Nice and full but not too much going on anymore. To be honest, I don't know what's gonna happen here, so we'll just see how it goes. I'm gonna grab uh, Empirical Sequencer from Alex Kidd. Where is mine? Where is mine? Let's try. Right now, let's grab a synth. You can use a sample if you want, it's up to yourself. One of me babies to rob hopping. Look at that. They go. Right, just let me pick a sound, turn this off, what it was. After that's on. Yeah, that's on, it won't work, so turn the sequencer off. Because the sequencer is the trigger when it's on, it won't let you trigger it with your MIDI controller. So. Let's see. This could take me 20 minutes or it can take me two hours, so I don't know. Uh, I may not even upload the video, I'll see how it turns out. So let me pick a scale. Let's go minor. Minor blue, let's try something different. Oh, yeah. We'll go F sharp. Right, we're gonna hit random, random, random. Right, let's play it. See what it spits out. No. That's pretty cool. I'll record that. Maybe I won't use it. But I might change the scale as well. But so if you want to record that, we go MIDI from Predator, and then boom. Sounds a bit different now. No, that recording MIDI. Here. Days. So I'll have that. Let's try some else. I'm gonna go C. off let's go I don't want all the notes that's how better with a different organ so let me go into my shiz and this little organ Royce if you're watching this this is the organ I made with you that day when you said how can I make this sound and yeah so this is what I do <laughs>
destroy card. I got fifth card. Let's see. <laughs> So there we go. Per grey start. To be honest, now I don't really need to generate ideas with this sequencer. Because it's after giving me that and now I can work with that. But let's just get rid of this and I will add a little bit of bass to this. So let me get a bass piece here. Classics. scale we in again C minor so let's grab the you know, so we can get that so essentially we are using the sequence of the idea don't know about that bass sound to be honest I think it might need some bit more of a sub Two saw, two saw waves. Yeah, I don't really want that. Back. Could follow that.
are spaced out bundle link in the description if you want it here's all the packs but we're gonna go classic stabs In that, so we need the EQ. Low end. So we can do that every second. Uh, pull it out so we miss it for a minute. Duplicate. And bar after bar I'd probably throw it in every eight bars or something like that right now we can what will I open now let me see could I have vocal mm -hmm. and let me go back to our bundle and retro vocals yes oh by the way I got a well what's that I want you to do me play a dozer. Uh, What's the matter? Didn't I pay you? You tell him. Were you devious? Let's do it for real. He had the fastest. You are. Let's do it for real. I don't eat. I just want a box from this, so. Just like a little story. Yeah. For real. Let's do it. Do it. Do it. Maybe the same organ. Just have it as a yeah, like with that, like spazzing in the hand, and then just that plus twelve sometimes. Sounds like new track. stuck now so I'm gonna go back to my go to the good old reliable no not the fucking profit printer I'm just gonna add a little pad over it needs something more straight more sustained uh, there's already enough melodies going on D sharp, maybe I'll go D 
t-shirt So you have the idea, give it a bash, see what you come up with. Sometimes you can start without the sequencer or start with it, it'll just have a simple bass line. Then for your next sound, choose the scale that you have the bass in. And just keep hitting random till you get something that you think sounds nice and then record the MIDI. Drag it back, turn off the sequencer and then adjust the MIDI to whatever way you want. So yeah, as always, like, subscribe, tell me what you want to see. Uh, I'm gonna try to try keep the ball rolling with this. So yeah, it'd be nice to get some ideas from people that are watching. And again, the link is in the description for the bundle if you want to buy it. And there's a free pack there as well if you want to check us out first. You can get the free pack. There's loads of good sounds in it. So yeah, see you later. Boom.